The days after Armenia's prime minister accused the top military officers of an attempted coup, political tensions remain extremely high in the country. The Armenia's president, interestingly, has now refused to sign the prime minister's order, dismissing the army chief. In a statement, the presidency has said, the president's office has said, and I quote, the president of the republic, within the framework of his constitutional powers, has returned the draft decree with objections. He further added that the crisis cannot be resolved through frequent personal changes. Earlier, Nikol Pashinyan, the prime minister, had fired the head of the general staff of Armenia this, as the military had called for his ouster. With the prime minister's grip on power appears to be slipping, hundreds of demonstrators have been rallying in the capital city of Yerevan, demanding for his immediate ouster. A leading opposition figure has also called on the Armenian army to rebel against him. In December 2018, Nikol Pashinyan's My Step Alliance had won the snap parliamentary elections, cementing his popularity in the country. But he has since faced calls to quit since November last year, and this of course has come as many have blamed him for the disastrous six-week war with Azerbaijan, one that saw ethnic Armenian forces lose out swathes of territory in neighboring Azerbaijan that they had held illegally since 1994. Vion is now available in your country. Download the app now and get all the news on the move.